Good morning, children. Welcome back to Form One Maths Class. Previously, we learned recap of numbers from one to fifty, recap of number names one to ten. We wrote in class workbook the numbers from one to fifty, and we wrote number names. From one to ten, you learned a format to write in your class workbook. Yes, I guess you all know how to write in your class workbook. Yes. Now, today we are going to learn writing the after numbers, the between numbers, and the lesser than and greater than signs. Okay, children, and we are going to use the same format for the all this work. So let's begin with the after numbers. Now, as you can see, there is a number line from zero to twelve. Now, one comes after zero. What comes after one? Two. What comes after two? Three. What comes after three? Four. What comes after four? Five. What comes after five? Six. What comes after six? Seven. After seven? Eight. After eight? Nine. After nine? Ten. After ten? Eleven. And after eleven, twelve. Right. You all have done this in real loop. Right. So today we are going to just take a recap of the after numbers, and we are. I'm going to show you how to write it in your book. Now let's take a quick recap. What comes after nine? What comes just after nine? Ten, right? What comes after zero? One, right? What comes after eleven? Twelve, yes. What comes after five? Six. What comes after eight? Nine. What comes just after three? Four. Now let's take it further. What comes after twenty-one? Twenty-two. What comes after twenty? Thirty-eight. Thirty-nine. What comes after sixteen? Seventeen. And what comes just after forty-four? Forty-five. What comes after fifteen? Sixteen. What comes after twenty-nine? Thirty. What comes after forty-nine? Fifty. What comes after thirty-two? Thirty-three. Right. Now, children, so now we are going to start writing in the class workbook. So open a new page, and children don't leave any pages in between. So last time where we did, after that take a new page, put a dot on the corner of the page, write down today's date twenty dot six dot twenty, and as I said earlier, the date is always written in the margin. It has to be within these two boxes. So please make it with a small handwriting so it can fit in. Then after that, a dot after the pink line. Then write the heading W capital H A T. What? One finger space. C O M E S comes. One finger space. J U S T just. One finger space. A R T E R after 
one finger space and a question mark. So, as it says, what comes just after? Then, we leave a line and we go to the next line. Now, before the pink line, we write one. Put a dot after the pink line. One, three, thirteen. In two separate boxes, again put a dot in a box and then make a line in two boxes. The line should be on the blue line, right, in the two boxes because the answer will be written in two boxes and line should be on the blue line, right. Now, leave a line. As I said earlier, you can put a small cross over here if you don't remember to leave a line. Then number 2 dot 2525 a dot and line in two lines. Now whenever we put a dot, children I have told you earlier that we put a dot to leave that box or that entire line yes then we again leave a line number three dot after the pink line four nine forty nine dot and again we put line in two boxes on the blue line leave a line number four now we put dot dot six why two dots over here? Because six is a single digit number and we always write six in one's place. So we put two dots, a dot after the pink line, a dot in tens place and then six, a dot. And even in the answer, you will be writing a dot seven, right? Because 7 again is a single digit number and you need to put a dot before writing 7. Whenever we write single digit numbers in certain pages, we always put two dots. Okay. So now I'm going to show you how the page is going to look like after finishing writing the whole page. The next slide shows the complete page. Like this one. So this you need to copy in the book the whole page and you need to write the answer like I have written one for you 13 what comes just after 13 it is 14 what comes after 25 it will be 26 so you have to write the whole page like this okay now you have already done the between numbers we are just taking a recap of these numbers so you can remember what you did. Now, let's take a quick recap. What comes in between? So, what comes in between 24 and 26? Can you tell me that? 25. Yes. What comes between 11 and 13? 12. What comes between 37 and 39? 38. Very good. What comes between 42 and 44? 43. What comes between 48 and 50? 49. Right. What comes between 18 and 20? Very easy. 19. Right. What comes between 29 and 31? 30. What comes between 36 and 38? 
37. Very good. So this was a quick recap of between numbers. Now I'm going to show you how to write it in the class workbook. I'm going to give you a few examples and then you will be completing the whole page on the next slide. Right? So this is how you write in your class workbook. As the pattern shows, as the format we learn, we put a dot on the corner, topmost corner of the page, the left side. Then we write down today's date, 20.6.20. Then we put a dot. Then what? W is capital H A T. What? One finger space. C O M E S comes. One finger space. I N in. One finger space. B E T W E E N. Between. And a question mark. Then. We leave a line. This line has to be left every time after the heading. Then we write one dot one zero ten in two separate boxes dot a dash in two squares or two boxes on the blue line like this one dot one two. 12. Right. The answer will be written in these two boxes. Right. What comes between 10 and 12? So 11, 1, 1, 11. Good. Now leave a line. And every time while you are writing, you have to say this 1 dot 1010 dot dash dot 1212. Leave a line. So Every time when you say leave a line, you remember to leave a line. Next is 2, then a dot after the pink line. One more dot, as you can see, there is a single digit number, 4. So we put two dots, dot, dot, 4, dot, then again dash, dot, dot, 6. So the answer will also be written dot, 5. Yes. Then again leave a line. 3 before the pink line. Dot. 2929. Dot. Dash. Dot. 3131. Now as I said I am going to show the whole page. The next slide. The whole complete page which you will be copying in your notebook. The class workbook. Like this one. Now here it is the complete page which you need to write with the answers. Right. So I guess you can complete it by yourself. Right. Okay. Now children, you have already done the greater than lesser than sign in prior look. You learned crocodile signs there and we are going to have a quick recap of that and I'm just going to teach you to write it in the page so after writing the between numbers take a new page and write put a dot on the topmost corner then we write the date 20.6.20 in the margin we put one more dot after the pink line. Then write the heading PUT put. One finger space. And the first letter should be capital. Then THE the. One finger space. C O R R E C T. Correct. One finger space. S I G N. Sign. And then we. Draw the signs, the crocodile signs, then leave a line, one before the pink line, dot, 
4747. Now, which is the bigger number? The crocodile always opens its mouth on the bigger number. So, 47 is the bigger number. So, we'll put a sign over here. This one, a crocodile opening its mouth on 47. Next, we leave a line. Write 2 before the pink line. Dot, dot, 3 dot dash in two lines and dot dot zero. Now three and zero being single digit number we always put an extra dot over here right before the number. Then leave a line three dot one one eleven dot dash dot one one eleven. So as you can see, this both the numbers are same. They are equal. So, we put, need to put in equal to sign. Right? So, we put in equal to sign. And children, the, please put the signs a small one, not very big one. Okay? The next page I am going to show you is the complete page of this page. And you will be writing that page in your class workbook. And finishing with the answers. So this is the complete page which you need to copy in your class workbook and complete it with the signs. This homework today is to complete the after numbers, between numbers and the greater than lesser than sign page which we wrote today in the class workbook. So you just need to complete the same pages. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye.